Darling people, and welcome back to your third video of the day. Remember, we will be live at 8 o'clock for the midweek fix, and there may be some more videos coming out as well. It depends what happens, because everything's moving thick and fast at Leeds United at the minute. Um, but this is an exit. An exit has been confirmed. Tyler Roberts has agreed a move to QPR on a season loan with a view to a permanent. So it's not just loan and back. 4.5 million move next summer if... He has a good season in the championship with QPR. The medicals booked in. It's all signed, sealed, delivered. Stevie Wonder tactics. There was interest from Sheffield United and Hull City, but London it is for Tyro. Um, it's a good move for him. Um, I think he will do well uh, in the championship. He just needs a run of games, doesn't he? And he never got that at Leeds United. And look, Leeds United bought him. Um, back in 2018, he came with, you know, quite a big reputation in terms of quite a few clubs were interested in him. Um, of course, he came injured as well, if I remember rightly. I think we paid about 2.5 million for him. So the fact that we can move him on with uh, an additional fee on top, you know, 4.5 million, maybe add-ons in, included as, uh, as well, is good business for Leeds United. I think we will see this with the model we'll approach. You know, we'll buy a lot of players that maybe might not make the grade and, and we will look to move them on and look. Tyler Roberts has got Premier League experience. That's another reason why you get a half-decent fee for him as well. And look, there was flashes, although they were only a few. I think he scored against Preston in Bielsa's first season. And, uh, you know, he, he got two against Hull City, obviously, a couple of seasons back, which showed what he can do. And he has got good feet. You know, he can move the ball really well. It's just what comes after that. His first, second touch was always good. And then it was, bam, into, um, you know, uh, you know, stumbling block or whatever, or just not releasing the ball at the right time. Um, but yeah, it looks like he's going to be on his way out. I wish him all the best, genuinely. I think he was the lightning rod for a lot of fans because he okay, probably wasn't quite good enough, um, wasn't good enough for the Premier League or especially in this Leeds United side and in that Bielsa setup. And Bielsa put a lot of faith in him and it used to frustrate people, especially when he was subbed on, etc. And I get it. And I understand it's best. For all parties, I think if 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 um, you know Tyler Roberts does move on, I thought he might have been alone and maybe come back or even given a chance in Jesse's system. Could he have worked in that central system? But Leeds United have moved on now. If you look at the players we're bringing in, Tyler Adams, Sinistera, Rasmus, Aronson, they're of a different level, aren't they? Um, so he's going to finalise a move to QPR with a view to a permanent of £4.5 million next summer. Um, there are also several championship clubs in the hunt for Jamie Shackleton, but no definitive movement on that one yet. And I'm led to believe from a very good source that Leif Davis could be on his way to Ipswich as well. It seems like they've come back in for him, and I don't know if he'll be going out on the... Uh, on the plane to Australia, although he's been doing well in pre-season, it looks like Ipswich maybe were ready to pay about a million pounds for Leaf Davis. So again, that's an increase um, on on the fee that we we brought Leaf in for, you know. So yeah, uh, there's going to be outgoings, and I think they're right. You know, Jamie Shackleton might be loaned without a perm, but I just don't see Jamie making the grade at Leeds currently. Unfortunately, sorry for that, but it is what it is. Um, it's nice to see Leeds United using the loan market to their um, benefit as well, even like the Creswell to Millwall, obviously that's no permanent, he will come back, but it's good that these players are going out and getting experience. But look, Tyler Roberts to QPR, best for all parties, I believe, and at 4.5 million when that move's made permanent, I think it's good business considering what we paid for him. So yeah, it's, it's decent, it's decent. And good luck, Tyler Roberts, good luck, Jamie Shackleton, good luck, Leif Davis. Good luck, Charlie Crez. We'll see you very soon. But yeah, look, there's going to be exit. I think that's all you will see. I don't see like a click or a foreshore or anyone on the periphery of the squad going. I think maybe their contracts run down as opposed to being sold. Um, but we'll have to wait and see. But I hope you enjoyed that quick video there, that quick update on Tyler Roberts and a potential move to QPR. Uh, join us tonight at 8 o'clock for the midweek fix. And I'll see you in a bit. Peace out. Lutitus. <laughs>